I'm good. being forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby, so. So if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. You want to do it, you let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime. And you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So no, he's not in the building? What do you know? I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Today's video takes us to Bueno Park, California, where we find a moron of all morons standing about on the sidewalk just recording because. Because why? I guess because he or she can do it. Whatever. Yeah, I don't get it. I really don't. It makes no sense to me at all. But sit back, watch, and <laughs> enjoy. Today I'm in Buena Park, California, doing a First Amendment audit outside of Amada, America. Seeing if my right to record in public, gather photo and video will be respected today from a public sidewalk. So stay tuned and we'll see how things go. Alright, here's a, a 360 where I'm at, off of Firestone Boulevard in Buena Park, just next to the Interstate 5 freeway if you're familiar with the area. So tell me again, how does this protect our First Amendment rights here in America? Uh, standing on a sidewalk uh, on a busy road next to a freeway and just recording a random business. This is First Amendment freedom protection, right? I understand. capability than I have before, so that's a big improvement. Here's the moron behind the camera. I was sure it was a guy a few months ago, but apparently it's a woman. But I'm not too sure about that either, and I don't really care. I'm just making an observation. But at any rate, uh, apparently she has bought a new camera with donations she's received, and she's all happy about that, standing out there, looking at the security cameras, looking at her, and what is the purpose of all this? Let's go ahead and speed it up a little bit because, as you can imagine, there's quite a bit of dead air. A few minutes later. Good morning. Hi. Are you here? Uh, can I ask why you're here? Sure. Go right ahead. I just asked. Oh, okay, yeah, you can ask. Oh, I'm gonna, uh, uh, no, I'm going to decline to answer that. Okay, no problem. Are you interested in a model? I'm going to discuss my business right now. That's right, baby girl, you tell him. You're not going to discuss anything because you're working on a top secret project for YouTube. You're gathering information for a story. You hope to make buku money. Oh, big click and views for you. Yeah, you tell you don't have to tell him anything. Exercise your Fourth Amendment, your Fifth Amendment, and all those other amendments. You exercise them, girlfriend. You go. Five minutes later. Someone else just coming out of property. He's coming over this way. Stand by. How you doing? Hi. Can I ask what you're doing? Doing some recording. For what? Uh, personal business right now. Personal business? Yeah. This is a private company. I'm aware of that, and this is a public no. sidewalk. That's 
Correct. So just come on the property. We'll get you removed, okay? Well, I'm not going on your property, so you don't have to worry Stay about it. Stay off that. of it. No, just worry about yourself. What's that? Worry about yourself, sir. I'm not the one standing here with the camera. So well, you're approaching a camera, so... I haven't come anywhere near it. Oh, now this is what really makes good content for YouTube uploads. When you can get somebody to come out and engage with you and get a little bit of negativity going, yeah, arguing is really good for YouTube content. Okay, Fraud Editor, uh, you're not done yet, are you? I don't think so. Let's get a few more jabs in, Fraud Editor. That's fine. You worry about you and I'll worry about me. How about you just shut your mouth? How about you just go back inside? Property. How about you just go back removed, inside? All right. How about you just go back inside? Mind your own business. It's a public sidewalk, stupid. Who wants to get arrogant with me? I'll get arrogant right back. Park orders. I have no intention of going on their property. And there's the walk of shame. I could never figure out why frauditors call it the walk of shame. This man is gainfully employed, frauditor, and what do you have? Oh, nothing. You have nothing. You upload videos to YouTube and make a few bucks here and there. So, who's doing the walk of shame? All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up, guys. Got a couple interactions here from Amada, America. First guy didn't seem like. back to him. I'm not going to take that in public. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to First Amendment Rights on YouTube. Like and share the videos. And also follow First Amendment Rights on Instagram and Facebook now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Hope you have a great day wherever you're at. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye. Well, there you have it, folks. This idiot's claim to fame was churches. He started out at churches, or she, I don't know, started out at churches, went away and ahead and went to sit-down restaurants, then moved on to fast food restaurants, gas stations. What is the purpose of all this nonsense? I don't get it. And plenty of people watch the channel. I don't get that either. Why are people wasting their time watching this nonsense? Well, at any rate, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel like this Dragon Society, please subscribe. <laughs> As always, thanks so much for stopping by. Cheers to that.